Yo, it's your boy Goons Out 16, man. What I want to talk about for a little bit is that without Wade thing, man. Is the Miami Heat better without Dwayne Wade? That's got to be the dumbest question I've ever heard in my life. Dwayne Wade is the franchise player, first of all. Without without Dwayne Wade, there wouldn't LeBron James be in Cleveland fucking up, not winning no damn championships. Chris Bosh be in Toronto, not winning no damn championships. Dwayne Wade made them come down here, so how is the Heat better without Dwayne Wade? And you can see, when they, the Heat is best, when they're out on the break, without Dwayne Wade, LeBron, LeBron and Wade are the two like, weren't the two fastest players in the league. So without one, how are they more effective when their best offense is on the break? That that makes no sense at all. So how are they better without Dwayne Wade? Dwayne Wade has great defense. He does. He basically does everything, basically. In the fourth quarter, gets you a big bucket, super clutch, super duper duper clutch. So, I mean, how are they better with that? It's so dumb. That's so dumb. Dwayne Wade was laughing at y'all clowns too. Whoever said that, he was just laughing at y'all, man. <laughs> but you know, I'll be back tomorrow with the uh, Chicago Bulls versus Miami Heat recap. Look out for that 3:30 Sunday. It's going to be crazy, crazy, fucking crazy, man. Say, But, uh, yeah, it's going it's gonna to be crazy, man. So look out for that shit. All right, deuces. Goons out 16. It's your boy. Hey.